Stray Kid is officially back with a new album. Ahead of the release of the repackaged album In Life and music video for the title track Backdoor on September 14, the group sat down to discuss the album. The member began by discussing the significance of their first repackaged album. Yunjin commented, as it our first repackaged album, it's a new sort of feeling. I am really curious about our fans' reaction saying we included the unit song from our concert that our fans have been waiting for. Felix said, I'm happy that we were able to show everyone Stray Kid unique charm through our first studio album, Go Live. It's thanks to everyone positive reaction that we were able to include our ideas and opinion in this album without any hesitation. The crew producing unit, Tri Raja, Bang Chen, Chang Bin, and Han elaborated on the difference between In and their previous album, Go. Noting that the repackaged album includes track from Ku with an addition of 8 new songs. Cheng Bin explained, We saw of the unique color of Stray Kid music in the previous album. So in this album, we try to include songs like love songs that will make people realize Stray Kid can do this kind of music too. Han added, in Go, we expressed the fearless ambition needed to plunge into life. In expresses the various emotions that unfold when we go through that life. The group then described the title track, Backdoor, embracing how the track invites the listener to a party with its energetic beat. Saying it's the follow-up track to Good Menu, we wanted to create a more exciting vibe in contrast to the powerful energy expressed through Good Menu. When asked about what inspired the unique lyric of the track, Tri Raja explained that they got idea from things they saw and heard in their everyday life. Chang Bin revealed that whenever an idea came to him, he would write it down before he forgot. Well, Han added that he received inspiration from movie and drama. The member then described their album concept with a modernist modernized version of the traditional Korean clothing handbook. When asked to select their favorite part of the concept, Yunjin commented with a loud, I think my long hair is definitely a point of interest. Please pay attention to it. Felix pointed out the member various unconventional hair color. Well, Sagmin selected the handbook outfit, saying that the clothing said the vibe of the song and the overall striking tanks in all of the member appearance. In addition to Victor, the group also recommended additional song from the album. Lee Noh and Hyunjin both recommended Wow, a unit track with a sexy vibe performed by the group dancer Lee Noh, Hyunjin, and Felix. Chang Pin recommended Tri Raja unit track We Go, while Sang Min recommended his and EN unique track My Universe, promising that the listener will gain strength from the sensor lyric. Han and Ian recommended all three of the unit track. Felix recommended Annie getting the track till vibe and rhythm. Stray Kid then shared some anecdote from the filming of the music video for Pector. Lino revealed we used equipment like a robot arm and a motion control camera to film. So we were all really amazed by that. Yunjin commented, 
instead of individual scene. There were a lot of group choreography, Saiyan, so we had to keep coordinating with each other. The way the eight of us filmed together for such a long time is the most memorable to me. He added, as on the rice cake and sauce cake that I ate in the middle of filming were delicious. The group wrapped up with some heartwarming words for their fans, known as Stay. Felix said, although we can see you all in person, we will always be with you through our music, so let's enjoy it together. I'm always thankful. Seungmin said, after all of our hard work, we are finally back with a new album and concept. I hope you look forward to it. We always be a group that stays by your side and does our best. Finally, I end commented, the first thing I want to say is thank you for loving and supporting Stray Kid from wherever you are. We will continue to show you what we can do, so please stay with us. BTS sat down for an interview on the radio show by Till Show Music Camp and talked about their latest single Dynamite, upcoming album, and more. Dynamite is BTS English language single that came out on August 21. It swept the chart in Korea and around the world and it's even taken number one on Billboard Hot 100 for two weeks in a row. During their September 14 interview on the NBC FM4U radio show, Suga said that while they had thought Dynamite migrates number one on the Hot 100, if they were lucky, they had not anticipated that the song would top the chart for a second week. They said that they received a call from big hit founder Bang Se Hyuk right away, and RM added that Bang Se Hyuk had been almost crying. Jin said he asked if we were all there and when he said we were he yelled yeah. The member added that he told them what an amazing assignment it was. Hus Baiju so expressed his gratitude to BTS commenting, I have been announcing the billboard Hot 100 chart every week for the past 30 years I am. 19 and 90. I have become quite old and I am close to retirement, but I was able to announce as a DJ that one of our artists topped the Hot 100. So now there's nothing else I could want, and I'm sure that they felt deeply moved. The DJ went on to say that he did have one more thing that he wanted mention, that he has been commentating the Grammy Award for 20 years and saying he plan to comment it one more time if the group get nominated. BTS asked him to continue to comment it and RM mentioned that the member and Bang Si Hyuk are member of the recording academy. When talking about their next album plans, Suga said it's coming out this year. There's not much time left, Jimin said, we are almost done working on it, I think it will come out around the end of the year. He added, this is exclusive information, but the music a bit better than Dynamite, we took it to give a surprising spoiler, the songs are about 3 to 4 minutes long. Jungkook said, the members were very influenced in the making of this album and RM said that their participation in their album will continue to increase. He also said there are a lot of different genre on the album and the song music are what are needed the most right now during this time. Bai Chilso went on to ask them to each name an artist that had the biggest influence on them musically. 
Suga mentioned that he started making music himself after hearing music by Epic High and he also shared that he really liked the rapper T.I. I was originally going to do a remix with T.I for my mixtape but it didn't work out he added Jin share the people who have really been a big influence on me are the member of BTS it was thanks to them that I started doing music and was able to write song too also saying they are the one who are most often singing by my set they have been the biggest influence on me